him know like my that. daughter Pearl. Yeah, I know. Yeah. And, and does these, she does my daughter them. Pearl is a farm girl. She likes to help us weed the crops here at Oxbow Farm. And she likes to plant the seeds sometimes here. And she likes to harvest all the good things that we have to eat here at Oxbow Farm. So I gave her a job this springtime. I said to Pearl, Pearl, we have some summer campers coming to Oxbow Farm in July and August. Will you please plant hey, August these carrot today. seeds and it's put them sister. in a kids' farm carrot bed so that they can pick carrots out of the kids' farm? And Pearl said, can do, Mom. I know how to plant carrot seeds. So I was very happy. She walked away with her little bag of seeds. But just like some of you, Pearl gets really busy. Pearl gets busy with playing with her friends, and she gets busy reading Harry Potter books, and then she gets busy like playing with the fairies at a, in our forest. So when I saw her last week and I said, Pearl, the campers are coming. Where are those carrots that they can harvest? She said, Mom, I forgot to plant the carrot seeds. Oh my gosh. Well, we have to have carrots for the campers. What are they gonna do? What kind of what kind of food are they gonna get out of Kids Farm? Maybe they can get some zucchini and maybe they can get some corn. But if they can't get carrots, they are gonna be disappointed. So I thought I would go to Safeway and buy some carrots. But if you've ever tasted a Safeway carrot, and if you've ever tasted an Oxbow Farm carrot, you know that the two are very different. Which one do you think is yummier? Oxbow Farm. Unbelievably so. So uh, we were in a conundrum. We were in a problem. But Pearl had a great solution to this problem. She said, Mom, well, I was not planting the carrot seeds, I was making a time machine. And I said, really? And she showed me this time machine that she made. And do you see inside there's some buttons and there's some levers? And she said, well, while I can't fit into the time machine and go back in time to sow these carrot seeds so that we can have carrots now, I do have my favorite stuffy, a little eagle named Squeak. And I will put Squeak into the time machine and Squeak can go back in time and plant those carrot seeds in April so that we can have them now. I said, Pearl, that's a wonderful idea. So Pearl gave Squeak a little kiss on the forehead and a bag of carrot seeds and said, Squeak, go do your work. And Squeak said, okay, Pearl. That's why she's named Squeak. She kind of sounds squeaky. So then Pearl puts her in the time machine and Squeak pushes some buttons and she pulls some levers and off Squeak goes. Whenever Squeak goes off into her time machine, can you guys help me do something? Can you go like this? Because that helps with the time lapse, okay? So off Squeak goes through time, way back in time. There goes Squeak. But she's not landing any time. It's been a half an hour. It's been an hour. It's been two hours. Finally, the time machine lands. And Squeak said, okay. Yeah, it looks like I can plant those seeds. And she goes out of the time machine. Do you think she sees Oxbow Farm here? She doesn't. Do you think that she sees any of the farmers here? She doesn't. Because on the time machine dial, it says 100 million years ago. Oh no, it broke. 
The time machine went way back. And what do you think she sees in the Oxbow Farm field a hundred million years ago? She sees a woolly mammoth out in the fields. And this woolly mammoth is fighting with a tyrannosaur. Oh my gosh! This is not a farm! What's going on? And then over, over where the barn is, she sees a great brown sloth slothing around <laughs> in a very slow way. Oh my goodness. And over by where the blueberries are, she sees a prehistoric rhinoceros. Whoa, so dangerous. Oh no, I don't see any place where I can plant seeds here. So Squeak very quickly gets back into her time machine and she pushes some buttons and she pulls some levers and doo -doo, doo -doo, doo -doo. off she goes to what she hopes is going to be spring of 2015. When she lands, she looks at the dial of her time machine. It's 20,000 years ago. Well, I guess I'm getting closer, but not that close. She walks out of the time machine. Do you think she sees Oxbow Farm here? No. no. Do you think she sees a barn and farmers in the field? No. 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 Guess who she does see, though? She sees some children, and they have baskets, and they are picking berries. They're picking salmon berries. They're picking thimble berries, all the native berries that grow around here. And then she sees over by the barn, their mother is cooking dinner over an open fire. <laughs> and then she, she sees their fathers are fishing in the Snoqualmie River. And so Squeak approaches one of the children and says, um, hello. Um, is this Oxbow Farm? And the girl says, I don't know what an Oxbow Farm is, but I'm picking berries for my family's dinner tonight with my other siblings. Oh, if you're picking food, that means you must be a farmer. No. Well, didn't you grow and pick this food? Well, I'm picking it, she says but I didn't grow it, it grew here naturally. And we share this food with all the birds and the animals. Who do you think these people are? Yeah, Sammy. Native Americans, that's right, who live here. Well, I think that um, I gotta go plant my carrot seeds. And the girl says, what are carrots? And Squeak says, oh, you don't know? Oh, they're really good. They're roots and they're orange and you, you pull them out of the ground. Well, I gotta go and plant these things. See you later, thanks. Bye. And she goes back into her time machine and she pushes some buttons and she pulls some levers and do 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 off she goes through the air and the time machine says 100 years ago and she's sailing over Oxbow Farm and she looks down and she sees finally farmers in the field and they're growing very tall plants called hops plants <gasps> but she's passing by because she knows that that is a hundred years ago <gasps> and she she continues on and then she she looks at the dial and it's 50 years ago and she sees cows and other animals way down there on oxbow farm land and, but then she passes by there because she knows it's not time to plant the carrots. And then 15 years ago, she sees some farmers in the field, in a little tiny field, harvesting food for their customers. But she passes by because she needs to find her way back to spring of this year so that she could plant these seeds.
and she gets there. And what do you think she sees in Oxbow April? Farm. She finally Oxbow. sees Oxbow Farm. I recognize this place. She sees Farmer Maya, and she sees Farmer Amber, and she sees Farmer Lauren out in the fields, and they are weeding the three sisters like they do so well. And she came up to them and says, um, excuse me, can you help me find a place to put these carrot seeds? I got to plant these carrots so that the campers can have carrots by August. And all the farmers help her figure out where to put these seeds. And guess what? Do you think that those carrots are here for you guys today to, yeah. to eat? Yeah. Thanks to the farmers here and Little Squeak, all of the carrots are here for you guys to pick and more. So enjoy yourselves out there and thank you for listening to our stories.